Hey guys, it's here bringing you another video. So welcome to the Extra channel, Huzzy Extra. And I know a lot of people go, whoa, he's uploaded. Yes, I have. Um, so today we're going to be playing some H1Z1. And just before we get searching for a game, I just want to quickly explain something. The reason why this video exists is because I've uh, made a realization. I warm up every single day before I play solo queue on a different game. Right now I'm playing a lot of H1Z1. Before it was Rainbow Six. It just depends what I'm in the mood for. And I just thought, why don't I record when I'm warming up? Like, doesn't that make sense? So that's what I'm going to do. Uh, if you do enjoy this, then throw a like on it. It's not going to be that professional. It's probably going to be unedited. Uh, but yeah, just to show you a couple things for those that play H1 themselves. I am on, I'm fairly new to the game, uh, but I'll show you my statistics. I'm currently gold five, which isn't great, but I, I, I'm fairly confident I'll be able to get platinum in the next week or two. Um, and my performances are voila. So the two ones that I went 6th place and ninth place have a little story to them in a weird way. Um, the 6th place one, my best ever one, I literally was spawned in the bottom right side of the map and the safe zone was in the top left. I had to run the whole way and I ran and I made it, made it to 6th place by running. And I didn't see anybody until I got shot in the head and I didn't see where that person was. So that was fun. Seventh place, that was a good game. And then ninth place, again, similar story. Like, I was spawned in the safe zone. I had all guns and stuff, so I was just like, I'm just going to chill here for a while. And I just went that. Uh, it was the Super Bowl night, so we had pizza coming. So I just went downstairs, got pizza, came back, and I was dead. And I got ninth place. I was like, oh, okay then. But that was fine with me. Um, So the one thing I'd say about this game that is a negative is that the rating system, you can be AFK. You can literally do nothing and get very high rated in this game. Uh, obviously, yeah, the, the the higher, higher ratings, you do need to probably get a lot of kills in order to get the extra points. But um, it's my one small complaint. It's the, it's the very similar, like, you could go AFK in League of Legends and get Platinum. Like, how weird would that be? Um, but no, it's a fun game. I'm not amazing at it. I'm still learning. I'm learning quite quick, I think. But because, um, you know, a few days ago, some of these performances would have been, you know, in the five to six thousand points is because I was treating this game like Call of Duty going run and gun, which you cannot do. Tip for you guys, if you're ever going to pick up this game, this is a camping game. This is what it's designed for. You don't yell camper in this game because that's what this game is. In Call of Duty, sure, if someone's on the map and hiding in the corner, you'd feel you'd think bad of them. Not in this game. This game is designed for that. So it's a bit different. It's a bit slower pace in places, but then, but then very quickly speeds up. Um, and if you're completely lost about what this game is, basically you'll you'll get a gist of it when we're playing. But it's an island that all players are spawned in, about 150 players usually, and you have nothing. You don't have any weapons, you don't have much armor, you don't have a backpack to hold stuff in. So you actually have to just go find all your loot. You have to find a gun, you have to find backpacks, you have to have bandages and survive. And uh, you'll be thinking, it's a big map. How do people, you know, why is there a thing that nobody just stays in the corner? There will be poison gas uh, eventually moving its way into what's called the safe zone and that you have to stay in. And if you're not, you're going to get killed by the poison gas. So we're in the, the little uh, thingy here. 166 players this game. So that was the loading area. Now we're about to load into the game, which you'll see very quickly, hopefully. Um, and then we'll be parachuting onto the island. It's pretty much that simple. There are vehicles in this game. And here we go. So when you're up here, you want to be like, all right, where do I want to go? So I'm going to go to this housing estate. But you always have to think, right? Everybody's going to go to this housing estate that's also near me. Everybody is scattered, by the way, in the air. Not everybody goes to the exact same place. Is there a car anywhere? I'd say the perks of having a very... Oh, there is. There's one right there. Alright. Let's just get the keys and the gas. And let's go in the house. So we probably don't want to overstay because we do now have a vehicle, technically. But my luck, we'll actually have to. Okay, there's a backpack and no guns in this house. Are you kidding me? I know there's Molotovs and stuff. People are like, take the Molotov. Nah. I'd rather... Did I take fall damage? Okay, at least we've got a pistol. So if someone does come, we at least can defend ourselves and not be like a baby deer. Okay, there's a shotgun. No, not in there. Keep reloading it, please. 
Okay, we've got... Oh, there's another backpack. You want to take extra stuff, by the way, because you salvage it and turn it into other stuff, by the way. Oh, come on. Jump. Oh, come on. You can make that jump. I took another point of fall damage. Oh, there we go. Always check, by the way, in this window if the front door is open. Because it's a big call if someone's been in this house. Come on, I need an assault rifle really badly. Oh, that garage door is open. You can't close them, by the way, so that's not a player opening it. Okay, this is still closed. Oh, there's a shotgun in here. So more ammo. That's good. Come on, assault rifle. Either AK or M16 or whatever it is. I really don't care. I'm not that fussy. Just give me a gun that goes brrrr and I'll be good. Okay, I think we'll just start heading the other way. So towards back towards our vehicle. One thing I learned, by the way, the other day in this game, you saw when I got in that truck, I took out the keys... And I took out the gas. The reason for that, I discovered something, is that I had keys to a car and I parked it to try and bait people. Uh, someone got in it and drove away and I was very confused. And I was like, wait a minute, I have the keys. Yeah, the vehicle keys are not bound to an individual car, apparently. They're just vehicle keys. Uh, okay, no one's been in here, I don't think. Sometimes in the bathroom there's med kits, but there's one. We haven't been that lucky this round, apparently. God damn. The reason why I don't really want to move away is because whenever you go on loot with a vehicle, you're so obvious that you're like you've arrived. So that's why I really want to find a gun, an assault rifle here without going in my vehicle. Is that one? Oh my god, we found one in a back garden of all places. Okay, at least we've got one of those now. I prefer the other one, but I think the AK is slightly better in some aspects. Oh, baby. There we go. This is the house we needed. I prefer the other one myself, the AR-15. Don't know if that's correct or not. Again, I'm fairly new to this game. so. And there's a shotgun there, so we can have more ammo. Always tend to carry my... Oh, helmet, lovely. Always ter uh, carry my shotgun while indoors because it's a shorter range. If someone walks in the house, then I can just blast them. Is my thought process anyway. Okay, time to head back to the car. Where are we? So we're here, so we need to get into this big circle here. So we need to go southwest. And this will require finding the car. Which I believe is this house, if I'm not mistaken. Nope. Which one was it? Oh, there. Uh, by the way, the colour of my truck did change colour. I've got... I'm ripping the... Um, the Twitch stuff. Okay, I need to go south... Wait, which way is it? South that way. Ooh, why am I going this way? I don't like being here, because I don't know if I'm the only one when I play this game. Whenever I'm in a vehicle, I always get a headshot. I don't know how much aimbotting or cheating in any way is apparent in this game. Again, I'm fairly new. But sometimes it's a little bit questionable how you die. It's like, I was in a vehicle turboing. Because there is turbo in this game. You press shift and it, it burns through your petrol quicker. But I was like, I was turboing and I literally got... I heard one shot and it was a headshot. It's like, is that legit? Probably, but you never know. But this is, by the way, what I do to warm up in League. Uh, it's because it gets my hands warm, my reflexes are going, it's first person shooter, right? But it also keep, gets me awake. This game is a very intense game that anybody, like, right now, I've watched tournaments in this game. There's probably 50 people around me, or there's probably 10 people that are literally watching me right now. It's intense, it gets your heartbeat going. And, you know, noticing this cabin, is the door open, stuff like that. You just gotta notice and it wakes you up. It's not open, is the back door open? Back door's not open, so it's unlikely someone's been there. So, actually, we need to just go more... Uh, wait, why am I going southwest? I meant east. Oops. Getting distracted while doing a recording. Nice one, me. Well, it means there's probably no one in this area. 
Uh, Vehicle-wise, cop cars are the fastest, I believe. And then pick up, uh, then these trucks and there, or these jeeps, and then there's pickup trucks. Um, I just need to go west. We'll we'll be fine though. The poison gas won't catch us while we're in a vehicle. Oh god, this is questionable. I don't probably want to go up a mountain because these cars, by the way, roll very easily, as you can probably see for yourself. Ugh. Doesn't seem to have all-wheel drive. Wait, am I actually going the wrong... I am so distracted while recording. What the hell? Everybody's probably shouting, Huzz, what are you doing? You're going the wrong way. I know. Oops. It, what it means, though, is there's nobody going to be behind us. Because we're right on the edge of the map. Probably. Ugh. I really don't like this mountain area. Ugh. Okay, now we're going the right way. Woo! Probably need to go southeast. So, like this way. There we go. Whoops. My bad, everybody. Oh, what? Yep, meant to do that. Okay, that made up for my mistake of going the wrong direction. That was beast. <laughs> I'm not even turboing right now. We're going really quick because we're going downhill. That's nice. Okay, caravan door open, which means player has been there. So we can't be thinking nobody's around right now. There very well could be. I've had the game, by the way, stop here once. That was interesting. No cover whatsoever. You're literally in a lake. Them planes, also, I did a bit of research on them. Obviously, they drop loot. But they do bomb runs. Yeah, the bomb runs are just random. They just pick on a random player. It's nothing to do with... Like, I thought maybe if someone stayed in the same position for ages, it kills campers. But no, it doesn't. It just goes on a random player. People have literally been the other side of the map in poison gas and still getting bombed. There's a guy behind us somewhere. Uh, caravan's open. I don't like the woods. Oh, there's a guy. Watch me get headshotted now. So he hit me twice. Hit me twice. And I'm in a vehicle. Like, what? Alright, I just put a med kit on myself. There's two people around. One in a car, one in not a car. They're having a fight now. Feel free. Right, let's just go behind this rock and put more bandages on. Just so that we get back to full health. But that's what I mean. Like, I literally am in a vehicle going relatively quick. And I get shot twice. Like, what? Alright, we're in the safe zone now. But where's it? It's probably going to stop in the city, I'd imagine. But maybe even in the hills. You can't predict it. Like, the big circle, it doesn't just go into the center of the circle. It can move around. Uh-oh. Over the ridge. Jesus, we have found everybody, apparently. So there's two tactics that people use. Either they'll go to where they think the, the round is going to end. They get there very quickly and they just camp. Or they'll go to the outskirt of the circle and they move in with the poison gas, thinking that there's nobody behind them. Both are good. Both can make you win the game. But um, both are annoying, to be honest. For someone in a vehicle. I don't like being in vehicles. Um, I might head to this store. Wait, is that cars? Or is that... Okay, they're just NPC cars. I was like, wait a minute. Uh, where's the store? Over that way. Yeah, I might head to this store. There could be someone there, but it's also a pretty good camping spot for a while. Hello? And let's just have a little quick wander. Door closed, door open. Door open, door open, door open. Okay, there's people here. Alright, nope. Alright. Let's keep going. Have a little drive. So how's everybody? So, again, I don't always go for crazy kills in this game. All I use this game for is to warm me up for League of Legends. And it's doing that, trust me. Like getting shot. That gets your heartbeat going while I'm driving around. Stuff like that. It's just little things. Ooh, okay. Caravan open. That could be a pretty good camping spot, actually. For a while. But I'm probably not going to camp like crazy while recording. 
because that would be very boring for the video. I'd rather drive around than camp while recording. But I'll say, if I wasn't recording, I probably would camp. Okay, I think that's the city of Cranberry. Cranberry. We we could go under the bridge and be a troll. Under the bridge. Ooh. Oh! Is he on the roof? I don't even know if that's shooting at me. I don't think I don't actually think that was shooting at me. Oh, he's on the roof over there. See him? He was back there on that roof in between the alleyway. He was shooting at me. Ah, so there's already people on roofs over here. Because they they probably think the game's going to end at this spot, right? So he's already getting himself on a roof just to camp. Okay, my car has seen better days. Ow. Still okay, though. 73 health is not terrible. Right, let's get out and have some fun, shall we? There he is. Damn. Ooh, ammo. Thank you. Any stuff here? I really love some armor. Ooh, more ammo. God, this game loves me today. Wait, why don't I have a help? <gasps> I got head- I did get headshots! So there we go, guys. I did- Duh. I actually did get headshot while I was in my car. If I didn't have that helmet on. Wait, that's a cop car right there, by the way. That's someone's car. I didn't realise they parked it in that garage. Lol. Is there someone in there? This is a thin- I think it's all kicking off on that roof. But I'm gonna guess there's only one way on it, right? One way on it. That is probably getting absolutely camped. Let's just swap to shotgun while we're in like a close range. Go, 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 go. Ooh, helmet. Thank you. Needed that. There could be people just camping in this building also, by the way. There's another helmet. And we could also do with this gun. I'll tell you why when I'm a little bit safer. Okay, this gun, the Magnum. Think of this gun as the sniper if you don't have a sniper. Single shot. But it's really long range. Let's go. Okay, we're going on the roof. If we can. I don't know if there's roof access though. Sometimes it's really hard to determine whether they're your footstep. Oh, there is roof access. Okay, we're trying to see. Because it was another roof, right? It wasn't this roof, I don't think. Or it might have been. I think it was... God, what roof was it? I have no idea. Or actually, we need to shut that door. Because if someone comes up behind us, at least we'll be able to hear the door open. Maybe. Turn my volume up. Um, okay, do we see anybody? We're going to go right to the edge. And I'm not, by the way. If I see someone on the floor, I'm not shooting them because I know there's people on the roof. So if I go for a shot on someone on the floor, I'm going to get shot. There he is. Was that him there? Right in front over that way? There's bombs. Where's the gas? 
So yeah, it is it is closing in where we are right now, so we're safe for now. Because the thing is, there could be five people on roofs doing the exact same thing as me, just proning. I know I, d I said I wasn't going to camp, but this isn't really camping. Well, it is camping, but it's more intense camping. Because so if someone pops up from a roof, bang, bang. Could probably actually go behind here. Please don't say you're throwing bombs again. Are you throwing bombs? Not here. Does N he is throwing bombs? That way. Oh, that's a see that green smoke over there? That's a military drop. There could be a sniper in there. Snipers generally make people win the game because you can be very far away, obviously. And shoot people in the head. Spider Man. Spider Man. Mm-hmm. The ultimate camping spot. Look at this. Dude. Oh, you can't go under? Uh, so this game, by the way, is still actually technically in development. Sounds a bit weird, I know, but technically it is. So it's not perfect, and it actually does go down quite a lot. Love it, this is enthralling gameplay, everybody. Okay, where is anyone? Speak now and forever hold your peace. There's my car! What was that? I think we're safe for here, roughly. Because we have the... No one's going to shoot me from that direction. I don't think anybody's that way. The I think people could be that way, like over here, and I'm protected by this air... Aircon unit. Someone just... That's my point, though. Someone just nick my car. If you have the components, so you had petrol on him, and he had keys, doesn't matter. I find that a bit weird. I think the key should be kind of to their car I don't think it should be a master key for every vehicle I'm trying to work out where the guy was that was shooting that we saw when we came in it was an alleyway it was like where's the alleyway you know, I could just jump on one of those buildings and then nobody would even think that I'd be on that roof because you technically can't get up there from inside. If, there's, if the circle closes in, I'm jumping on that roof down there, by the way. So there's 20 people remain. Just checking no one's already... Wait, what was that? I thought I saw someone on the fire escape then. Car. See it? Kinda. There he is. If he stops, he did stop. I'm just looking down that alleyway down there. Because if he stopped there. Could just go in a building again. Roof access somewhere. My God, is that a person there? Nope, oh, it's trash cans. So everybody does have binoculars, by the way, which make it a little bit more easy. There's the gas, by the way. See that green? That's the poison gas. But the 17 people remain. Everybody's within the circle, by the way. You have to be, otherwise you're going to get completely gassed out. Um, 
and there's the gas coming. You can see it literally making its way in. So we've done the tactic this game, like I mentioned the two, that one, you stay on the outside and you move in with it, because I can guarantee, you see that gas, there'll be... I wish you could look down a lot easier from this way. Also, if someone opens that door, bang. Um, yeah, there'll be people on the edge of that poison gas. M moving their way in with it. And then there's people with, with, like me. There's probably about five, I'd say, people around me right now. Literally, there could be people... Remember, there could be people in my building below me. Um, there could be about five people around me. Very... That's a person on the roof. Okay, we got one. See what I mean? As I said, there's, there's, oh my god, there's a military drop right there. Are you kidding me? No, who, nobody's going for that. Nobody's going for that. They're dead if they do. Okay, we're still in the circle for now. There's another person around, because the person I killed, he was shooting someone. Until I was shooting him. Remember, we do have the bombs that are going to be killing people too, potentially. I think that was just a truck beeping its horn. Just checking the roofs very casually. Because again, see that door? That's open now. I don't know if that was open before. So there could be someone proning on that building and we can't see them. So that's a bit annoying. Ooh, this game, man. Not bad for a warm-up round. This is literally my first round of the day and we're already in 11th place. We're probably going to... There was someone there, wasn't there? No, it was a shadow. We're probably going to get top 10. Um, in our first round of the day. That's not bad. That's what I mean. I'm probably going to get higher ranks because I'm, I'm working out how you're supposed to play this game. Oh, we have to move. No. So see the circle? It's gone. Out of where we are. There's going to be like no cover there. So you now you ask yourself the question. We have two and a half minutes. Either wait here as long as we can. And then just run in. You can run in poison gas for a while by the way. You just have to heal yourself. And we do have a med kit so we can do that. And I do know there's a cop car over the side. Over the street. So I could just get in the cop car and just drive very fast. If I wait a long time. Or there'll be people moving there right now to try and have a good camping spot. There's bombs. Kill someone. Nah. That would have been really nice if it killed someone. Um, but there's also there, there's also the chance that there's people literally in my building below me. What we're going to do, we're going to start making our way down. Let's go first person. Should we clean the floors? Just to warn you, this game is not a horror game, but it does have jump scare elements if someone is just hiding. So, if someone is hiding and they kill me, I'm not being a wimp in jumping. I just got surprised. <laughs> Clear! That's what they say, right, in the movies? Okay, we don't actually have enough time to do this. There so has to be somebody in this building. It's a huge building. There's 11 people left. God, I didn't realise we were in this far up. Oh, 
crossbow. I went out the wrong side of the building. Hobbada, 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 hobbada. Don't mind me, don't kill me. We're being a little bit reckless here. All right, uh, north, east, south, west, west. Ooh, turn, turn, there we go. <laughs> so where's the zone? Over the river. Wait, that's a military crate. Eh. Was that a sniper? Yep. Someone's got the sniper, everybody. That's going to be fun to deal with. Ooh, there's a guy. Why do I have my shotgun out? No! I didn't realise I had my shotgun out. This is me being a noob, everybody. I didn't realise I, I got on my car, ready to shoot him, and I had my shotgun, not my assault rifle. I did hit him once, but it was too far a range. Oh, that was such a noob mistake. Well, there we go. This is how I warm up uh, to play League. Literally, after this recording right now, I'm going to go play solo queue. So, if, yeah, if you enjoyed this and you want more of it on the extra channel, throw a like on it. And hopefully I won't noob out. Because, literally, I could I could have killed that guy if I drew my assault rifle, not my shotgun. And, yeah, check that before. Because the, the, the gun that you hold in your hands before you get into your vehicle is is the gun you're going to have when you get out of your vehicle. So I must have been holding my shotgun, which makes sense because I was running to the car in the street, so I would have had my shotgun out. Damn, that was a rookie mistake. Oh, anyway. Okay, if ninth place for a warm-up round. That's fine with me. We probably got ranked up, actually. Should we check that really quick? Yeah, let's check that really quick, actually. It's worth noting. Ah, uh, damn. We did quite well, though. That's fine with me. Uh, I can't believe it. Of all of it to end then. It's like, ugh. All right. Character, stats, leaderboards. So we went up to gold four. So we were gold five and now gold four, I think. And in order to get to gold three, we need to have 141,000 more points. Just to kind of say what that means is your top 10, I might have said it at the beginning of the video, but your top 10 performances all add up and the added up score, the total score will mean what rank you are. So basically I need 140,000 more points to get ranked up to goal three. So that that one at the right, the 48th place, if I make that another 112,000 round and then I make the 47th one another 112, that's where you gain more points. So if I make all of my top 10 matches in the top 10 of surviving, boom, we'll probably be platinum. So that's pretty cool. Uh, but yeah, if, if you did enjoy, throw a like on it, subscribe if you haven't, and I'll see you guys next time. See ya.